I have a mini Sephora haul. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome to today's video. I'm excited about this one because it is um, more or less a mini Sephora haul. I hardly ever get to do hauls only because like I don't buy a lot of stuff at Sephora, like ever. I'm going to open the box here and I want to show you guys everything that I got in my Sephora order. Okay, let's start out with number one, which is the Coco Mademoiselle. It is a, it is a sampler. And one thing that I've really liked about Sephora lately is that they've been including a lot of samplers and you can actually choose which sampler you want to like receive. So I wanted to receive the Coco Chanel Paris Mademoiselle. I've worn it twice now and I actually really like it because it's super florally and it kind of reminds me of my old Gucci Premier perfume, which is like my obsession and they don't make it anymore. Okay, so that's a, a sample that I got. And then the other sample that I chose was the Aqua Gio Giorgio Armani. I think this is the male version. And I got this for my husband because I was like, hmm, I want you to smell good. So I got him a sample size so we can see how he smells and if it blends well with his chemistry and see if he really likes it. And, you know, if I do another Sephora order, maybe I'll order him another sample. All right, so we have some makeup products in my box here. These I ordered online. They were actually all on sale. Actually, not all of them are on sale, but there's some stuff that was on sale. I will share with you guys the prices of each one. The first one that I ordered would be the KVD Lightweight Full Coverage Concealer. This is the Good Apple Concealer. I was actually able to purchase this one for $16. For some reason, it was half price. I did get the shade Light 103, so I'm excited to try that one out. It was half off. I was like, oh, like that's awesome. The other thing that I did also purchase that was on sale was the Huda Beauty Matte Obsessions. I got the Huda Beauty Warm Matte Obsessions palette. This was also 50% off, so I got it for $16. This one's like more of a warm toned one and it actually reminds me of like pumpkin spice makeup with these like super orangey tones in here. So I got it for $16. I was super excited about this one. I saw some mixed reviews on it, but I love Huda Beauty. And for $16, I was like, okay, we can figure it out. And then I also got a Sephora Mascara Brow Volumizing. It's a brow mascara with fibers in it and this one was also 50% off I believe I got it for like five dollars this one I more or less just bought what shade did I get soft charcoal which is like a cool but dark tone because I have really dark eyebrows they're actually black they are not brown they are black and they're very like very thin and long so I got the fiber mascara for my brows just to like fill them in more see how it works and it was on sale for five dollars and I've actually needed another brow mascara because I don't have one anymore I don't and then I also purchased this little guy it is a mini it is the flawless filter from Charlotte Tilbury this one was actually full price and I'm not very happy with how much I paid this one this one made me a little bit upset when I opened it because the Hollywood Flawless Filter retails for $20. You get 0.18 fluid ounces. This isn't even a concealer size. Like this is like teeny tiny and I was not very happy with this. The reason why I purchased it is because I'm actually working on another dupes video and we all know that it is a dupe for something made by e.l.f. And if you don't know what it is, just stay tuned for my dupes video. And then the other thing that I did purchase that is in a mini size because it was $28 instead of like the $70 of the full size one is the Airbrush Flawless Filter Powder from Charlotte Tilbury. And I opened this up. When I opened this box up, I was like, are you kidding me? Like this thing is so teeny tiny. So it comes in this itty bitty teeny tiny little box. And then here's my sample. This is so tiny. It comes in 0.11 ounces of product. Like this is so tiny. But to give you a reference, this is my number seven perfect light powder and this is in 0.35 ounces. This teeny tiny little thing is 0.11 ounces. Like this is so tiny compared to the number seven one. Like look how tiny this is compared to it. So this one was $28 for this teeny tiny little nub of nothing but I bought the mini size to try it out and also do as a part of that dupes video, it's gonna be included that one as well and you guys will see the dupe for this one possibly and I wanted to try it out and see how Charlotte Tilbury stacks up. I was actually thinking also with the purchase of this one that it might be really good for 
like traveling because I am taking a trip to Las Vegas in December. So I was like, oh, maybe this would be a good one to take traveling with me because it's very travel friendly. Five things that I purchased from Sephora, my mini Sephora haul. If you guys want to see more hauls like this, please leave me a comment down below. I haven't done one in a while. The last one I did was like Ulta from like, I think three or four years ago. <laughs> For the, for the Ulta 21 Days of Beauty. So if you guys like content like this, please consider subscribing. I will try to put more out there, but typically I don't have a lot of hauls, but I did want to share this one with you and kind of give you a sneak peek into what is coming. Thank you so much, and I hope I get to see you again. Bye.